So what was this first time environment in life and first time setting for you? Uh, I was really nervous um, coming to a new program, new coach, new team, new state, new country. So I was just very nervous and I think I may have showed a bit, but honestly my teammates had my back, coach had my back. So it was it was great with the crowd and the band. It was a it was a really great experience and I think now I just gotta embrace it each time step out on Mackey. Uh, do you feel like your style fits what Katie wants done? I think I think it does. I I'm a transition point guard. That's what I like to do. Use my speed. Uh, that's my strength. Um, but also, she does want a balance between speed and composure. You know, because you know sometimes just beating everyone up the court, there's sometimes nothing there. So it's just you know maintaining that nice tempo. And I think with uh, runners as shooters like Cass and Madison, we really had a good balance. We had some good momentum. And then with our big range down the post, I think we have great potential to be a dangerous transition team. Yes, yeah, so with the transition, I mean, it, it seemed to go pretty pretty fluid today. And granted, you know, a lot of, you know, who you're playing and, and that, those kind of things, but is that how it needs to look for this team to be successful? I think so. I think, well, our philosophy is if you beat them down the court, there's more layup opportunities and, you know, we get, we get to score buckets that are easier. So I feel like that's something that we've put in our brains, that, sh that coach has instilled in our brains to get quick scores, but it is something that's going to be a trademark that uh, c coach wants to be a trademark. And, you know, I think with the more we practice and then the more we, you know, play games, we're just going to get better and better at it because we, we're a running team and we've, you know, we've worked hard con conditioning to be a running team. So it, it's been it's been a tough summer, but I think it's really paid off, and especially today it showed that. So why did you end up here? That's, that's a great question. I uh, p personally, I just wanted to, you know, Go, go up in my basketball and going into like a power five conference the big 10 was something i was really looking into and purdue were one of the first actually the first school that reached out to me as soon as i entered that portal and it was just a great sign and i love i love the coaching staff i love the girls i mean i had to commit without a visit so it was i was going in blind but honestly it exceeded my expectations and i'm so grateful and glad that i got this opportunity to play with this squad and it's definitely a special team this year so what was it like when you, when you finally got here and saw everything? Oh, at first I saw all the cornfields in Indiana from the airport. Uh, so that was like, I was like, oh, that's different from California. Uh, but the, my first impression was that, okay, these girls are strong and they're big. That was my first impression. But off the court, lovely. And, you know, we bonded straight away. But I knew I had my work cut out for me. And, you know, some, being summer and being able to have all those hours with the team, it, it was great. And I think that bonding off the court really made us a nice team on the court. Um, I mean, probably wasn't the smoothest summer that, I, that we all wished for. But I think it made us stronger as a team and as, you know, the connections with the coaches so yeah I, I mean it was it was definitely great was, was basketball always your sport of choice in australia uh it i actually um there was a there's a sport called netball in australia that i also was very uh into which i think actually helped my basketball so i played that until i was pretty much um, all my juniors and then i had to decide netball or basketball and then college just i couldn't see any uh, you know, bad thing about college. That was my dream. I always wanted to do that. So, basketball took the took the win there. But I mean, I'm, I'm living my dream right now, so I can't complain. Thank you. Thank you.